fucked up. So I heard that Empire got canceled. Wow. Now, Jesse Smollett ain't the reason for it to get canceled. How about the fact that it's been a whack show with some... Yeah, it's supposed to have been about the music industry. First, they tried to say it was part Jay-Z, some of Puffy, maybe some of Shug. I don't know. You know, some people had the issue with the homosexuality of the thing going on, the direction they went. And that is common in the music business. So don't act like that. You know, and that doesn't bother me in terms of what people do in their personal business. It's just that they made a, a purpose to throw the um, this the agenda. That's what changed the landscape. And, um, you know, they made it a thug, sexualized... But let me tell you something about Empire. Empire basically became like a uh, Jerry Springer show after a while because they tried everything. Uh, you know, uh, Lucia's getting kidnapped and then a psychopath and then bipolarism, mental disorder. I'm like, they tried to do too much. Then you end up losing the meat of the matter. What is the show trying to do? For me personally, if it is the end of the show... They did a disservice to Terrence Howard and Taraji Henson because their chemistry from Hustle and Flow go back. Them two deserve more meat and a better show to represent their skill set. So they didn't get the justice. They had to play second fiddle and stupid plot lines. I don't know what Lee Daniels was thinking sometimes. Now, the funniest one was season two, which was a bad joke. When you got Chris Rock as the prison kingpin that alone <laughs> that was hilarious <laughs> i was like i know right then and there i'm like you know your show ain't gonna last for long that's not even believable in his own household let alone on small screen come on down but um the prince tribute was cool because lee daniels was extra on the purple rain set back in the day and when they were sticking to the musicality aspect, they had some moments. You know, Terrence Howard is actually is he's a musician. Taraji does some singing, Jesse Smollett. And you had some talent on the show. And you had and you you know, when you can bring Mario back from the grave, because let's be realistic, 2004 was a long time. They brought some people on board, you know. But the plots and the thickening and you know, they tried every concept, which I will say this in, in their defense. Had they been on cable like Power, been interesting. Had Empire been a future film, interesting. I really believe that if Empire had been handled the right way, dare I say, it could have been like a black version of Sopranos. Because it had, when you're dealing with the music industry and hip hop nature, and you're dealing with a, a certain aspect and element, um, there's things that you can do. But it didn't get cultivated near enough. And while it'll be, member, be remembered, it ain't going to be remembered the way it should have been. It should have been one of the greatest black TV shows ever. Because it had the premise to really do something. And it kind of dropped the boat. Kind of dropped the mark uh, where that goes. So um, it's hard to say what is Empire's legacy. What's its lasting impression? But if it is over... You know, they got five years, they got residuals, and they got, you know, maybe a movie in the future. You know, who knows? Because it, it was, it could have been more dynamic than it than it was. So, But anyway, uh, that's my take on Empire. And it definitely left a lot of people thinking that, you know, the, the knock was black people, and then it's just dysfunctional, and just hypersexual, and... All the things that were, that weren't a lot of positive came out of it. And like I said, they wasted Taraji Henson, who's done a lot of movies. So she, and of course, Terrence Howard, who, for my money, if Terrence gets the right role, he's a, he's a real good actor. And a very good actor. Could be great with the right roles. So, but anyway. Um... Because before, because you think about it with Empire, Taraji Henson, people slept on her for years, you know. And so this TV show did wonders, you know, it's Cookie Lions and Lucius, you know. So, but anyway, um, that's my take. 
the end of the line for the TV show Empire. Feel free to leave comments, hit the subscribe, and leave some suggestions, whatever you feel. So the bell rings us in the video. You have a good day, and I'm out.